Happy Family is one of the largest and fastest growing organic baby food brands founded in 2006 by Shazi Vizram, a self-made entrepreneur who sold 92% of the company to Group Danan in 2013, reportedly for some $250 million, but she remains on as CEO and joins us now to talk about Happy Baby's latest launch. Shazi, thank you so much for joining us. Just this week, you are launching an organic infant baby formula. Is that right? It, it's supposed to mimic breast milk. Well, um, so what we're launching into is actually infant feeding. Uh -huh. And so the idea is we want to support mom um, regardless of which direction she chooses. So we have a whole line for breastfeeding support. And I mean, I'm a big breastfeeding supporter, but I also know how hard it is personally. And, um, and so we also have a line of organic formula that is modeled after breast milk so that regardless of which way you go, you know, you can have something that you feel good about and trust and from a company that really, uh, really does care. And do you think there's a lot of anxiety these days around breastfeeding with mothers? Oh, absolutely. And I, I think it's um, honestly, Part of my message is it's time to stop with the guilt. Mm -hmm. You know, the one thing that happens when you become a parent is you lose time and you have less time. And for me, the biggest waste of time ever is guilt. And so what we need to do is arm ourselves with information and be able to make the best choices for our family. And how did, how did you do that? I mean, CEO of this huge company, you've got, how old are your kids now? So I have a seven-year-old and a nine-month-old baby. But Baby, so how, what are your feelings about breastfeeding? Do you have time to do it? Um, so, I mean, I'm done. For me, yeah. with my, my son, who is seven, when he was first born, um, I, I was a champion breastfeeder. I mean, I was able to breastfeed him actually for two and a half years, which is a really long time. Um, it turns out that I really think it helped create a very healthy microbiome for him that helps him today um, overcome other challenges that he has. And um, with my daughter, who's now nine months, I was able to breastfeed exclusively the first three months. And then um, I was traveling so much for work and really busy, and I think it's different the second time around. Every pregnancy is different. I just, I had a much harder time with it. You know, I was eating our breastfeeding nutrition bars. I just wasn't making enough milk. And uh, initially, I was, I was actually getting a, an infant formula from Germany. Wow. And then ours literally just came out a few months ago, and I've been able to give it to her since then, and I feel very comfortable knowing it literally is the best organic formula in the world. So this comes from a personal place. It's not just savvy marketing. Yeah, for, for sure. I think, um, you know, it's a unique, a unique business in the sense that uh, it's really a labor of love, mm -hmm. and um, I truly believe that if we are to create a better future for our families and our children, we need to limit their exposure to pesticides and toxins and chemicals in the environment, and organics is the healthiest way to feed our babies. You looked into that specific industry and you said, hey, there's room here for disruption. A hundred percent. What was unique about it is at the time, you know, really, this was now, what, 12 years ago, yeah. um, baby food had been created in the 1930s to be very convenient and very cheap. Um, there really wasn't a focus on value or Health. Um, or, or real nutrition. Yeah. And so what I saw was this opportunity to create something that was actually focused on true enlightened organic nutrition mm -hmm. that could be a warm modern brand, um, not very goo goo gaga, but really something that was appealing and also uh, be kind of a, a platform to educate parents around sustainability. And you started with, you know, input, you know, funds from friends and family, right? 20,000 here, 10,000 here. And now what is your <laughs> annual revenue roughly? Uh, well, uh, last year we did about 150 million in sales. Amazing. Um, which, and is that ballpark yeah. figure that you sold it for about 250, is that about right? It is, it is in the ballpark. In the ballpark. Well, congratulations, it's, it's incredible. And now you're, you have about 100 products sold in, what, 34 countries? Uh, at least 34 countries, and I think we have 186 products. Shazi, thank you so much for coming to see My us My pleasure. Today. Thank you.